So hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Uh, today I'm going to be vlogging my 12 hour tennis match. Uh, this is going to be for two charities, winning it for UNICEF in the Yemen and also the East Cheshire Hospice. Uh, at the moment it's not raining, it is a bit windy, uh, but hopefully I'm not too tired at the end of it. Uh, and I'll be vlogging throughout the day, so enjoy. So it's 8.03 a.m., 12 hours starts now. Right, it's two o'clock, which means I'm halfway through. I've just finished playing with these guys, Ellie, Anna, Mike, and Elliot. Uh, so six hours left. My legs are feeling pretty tired. My back's hurting quite a lot, uh, and it's pretty windy, which is a bit annoying. But other than that, everything's gone pretty well. Uh, so yeah, the rest of the six hours. <laughs> So it's the day after, it's Monday morning and I am shattered. Uh, I woke up about eight this morning, uh, just killing my sunburn on the back of my neck, which you probably can't really see, uh, kills. Uh, my wrists, I've got blisters all over my thumbs. Uh, my feet don't actually ache that much, but that'll probably come. Uh, so yeah, I wouldn't recommend doing a 12 hour tennis challenge, <clears throat> but it was obviously worth it. We've almost raised a thousand pounds towards the two charities, uh, which are UNICEF and the Yemen. Uh, so obviously Yemen are in the middle of a crisis at the moment anyway. A civil war has uh, caused a lot of poverty over the country and UNICEF are trying to improve the situation over there, uh, especially for kids. And coronavirus has worsened it. And also the East Cheshire Hospice uh, in Macclesfield. So a review of the day, it was pretty windy all day. Everyone that came complained about the wind, uh, which threw the balls everywhere. Uh, from like eight o'clock in the morning to eight o'clock at night, it did not stop. And then in the afternoon, it was on and off showers. Uh, it rained pretty heavily at one point, but we carried on through it. Uh, I, we only got 15 sets done. I think I, I won 10 five in sets, 10 six in sets. Uh, so I don't have to do the forfeit of wearing a Liverpool shirt. Uh, 
Uh, but yeah, I enjoyed it. Thanks to everyone that came down, from people that had never played tennis before to people that I've played with for years. Uh, I enjoyed it, apart from the last two hours, which were awful. Uh, uh, and I got my pint at the end of it, which was, which was probably one of the better parts. <laughs> currently in a hostel in Milano in Italy uh, and I've checked the Just Giving and we've raised over a thousand pounds which is great we're on 1055 uh, we've also managed to get in the Wormslow Guardian which is really good I think a few people donated through that uh, so yeah I repeat again thanks for everyone for coming down uh, I've always wanted to raise uh, organize an event to raise over a thousand pounds for charity which I've now managed to do we also broke the Guinness World Record for the longest tennis match so if you want to continue donating I'll leave a link in the description uh, I'll also update you on my injuries which uh, and my ankle pain has only just gone uh, so that lasted about three weeks uh, which was really painful I think I might have sprained it or fractured it uh, in the last two hours uh, but other than that it was a success and I'm very happy with it and I will see you in the next one, which will be a travel vlog of my current trip.